today I'm going to tell you that how you can use the jQuery file in our PHP sorry HTML file how you can use it simply go to the Google go to the Google search engine and type the jQuery download we will show the number of links here and the first link open that is the jQuery professional website and here you can see the latest version of jQuery that and uh, you can find the compressed jQuery and uncompressed jQuery file uncompressed development jQuery file compressed jQuery file means that is uh, the, uh, the main difference between them the size size compressed file means the size is uh, very small and the development file is that is a very large file if you want to show it you can show and check it i have opened it there this is uh, this code is the compressed jQuery file and you can see this code easily but you can't understand that how this code is actually working if you want to understand that code you can go the uncompressed and development file you can so see that how this code is work and the main idea behind that we are why we are using the jQuery file because the jQuery when we are going to use it uh, when sorry we, if we are not having the knowledge of JavaScript then it is very easy to use the jQuery and using jQuery and every task is uh, very simple how how we can do I will tell you in next tutorial but this in tutorial I will tell you that how we can use this file this jQuery file in our system so here we are going to use the compressed file simply select all then control s when we are going means we are going to save that that file on our system i have already downloaded this file so uh, click on no and here yeah, that file is this and i can show you that the file version is 1.11.3 and here you can see easily that I have used it by 1.jpl 1.11.3.1.js. You can change the file name also, or you can simply select all, copy the file name, and I have one. I have written one simple HTML code where I am going to use this file to simply paste on it. Yeah. Here you can see that the script, the script type when we are using uh, the jQuery files in our HTML page, we have to define the script type that is text in JavaScript. Why we are typing in JavaScript because the jQuery the code is a part of javascript so that's why i am writing here then source src means source source of the file means where we are going to, uh, where uh, this file is stored that file is stored on simply desktop and this code is also uh, this code this code is also on desktop and this uh, jquery file is also on desktop so here you can see but so that's why we are not going to if this is any folder suppose These files are now these files are in the uh, folder of jQuery. So here we write jQuery.
right here and then we write the name of the file means we are going to decide where we, uh, where we have this file and simple copy the path and paste on this then the, uh, if you are going to use this file in your HTML file you have to remember that if it must be if possible then it must be uh, put the file of jQuery in your head on your head of HTML page otherwise you can put it in body also but here you have to remember that this code is just the closing body tag above just above of the college closing body tag it uh, may not be that uh, you have written a uh, uh, written over that uh, something like this you use uh, you can use that this thing but uh, this is not a legal way of using the script file so you can put this tag on a bubble yeah. this is the right way of writing this descriptive page or descriptive code so thank you for watching this tutorial